The federal government has arrested the leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, Namdi Kanu. The Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abakra Malami, who made the disclosure to journalists on Tuesday, revealed that Kanu was arrested and brought back to Nigeria on Sunday. He said the arrest followed a collaborative effort between security agencies in Nigeria and Interpol. He has often jumping bed, been accused of engaging in subversive activities that include inciting violence through television, radio, and online broadcast against the Nigerian state and institutions. Kanu was also accused of instigating violence, especially in the southeastern Nigeria, that resulted in the loss of lives and property of civilians, military, paramilitary, police force, and destruction of civil institutions and symbols of civil authorities. Self-acclaimed leader of the proscribed secessionist indigenous people of Biafra, Namdi Kanu, has, for your information, been intercepted through the collaborative efforts of the Nigerian intelligence and security services. He has been brought back to Nigeria in order to continue facing trial after disappearing while on bail regarding a living count charge against him. Recent steps taken by the federal government so to the interception of the fugitive Kanu on Sunday, the 27th day of June 2021. Inande Kanyi Namdi Ngozi Chuku Oku Kanu was born on the 25th September 1967 at Afarauku, Abia State, Nigeria, and indeed a holder of Nigerian passport number AO A0513682754. First issued on the 17th October 2013 at Festac, Lagos. For your information, distinguished members of the press, Kanu is as at now being produced before Federal High Court in continuation of hearing of his case in respect of which he has evaded and indeed jumped bail. Meanwhile, Kanu has been taken before the Federal High Court in Abuja for the continuation of his trial on charges bordering on terrorism, treasonable felony, unlawful possession of firearms and management of an unlawful society.